Hey, hi all. In this video, we will see uh, how to create a data set from a CSV file or how we can upload a CSV file to create a data set. So first we have to navigate it to Analytics Studio and then we have to just hit on this create button and then on the data set. Uh, then we have to select, uh, there are multiple options to create a data set as you can see. First is CSV file, then Salesforce data. Then we have external data and your data sets. It means that uh, you can have two, four, multiple data sets which you have created already. Out of that, all the data sets you can work uh, accordingly, like uh, the permutation and combinations on the particular data sets to create a new data set out of the data which is there in the in that particular data sets. Uh, so in the on that in that case, you can use this. So as of now, we will see for the CSV file. So I have a CSV file. Uh, so this is, it will take some time, I think so. Okay. So I've selected the CSV file now next. Next, what we want the data set name to be. So you can name it anything. Worldwide flags in which app you want to store it in the private app or in, in whichever app you want to see it, you can choose it. Then these are the properties detected, and this is the schema file. Now you hit next, and then these are all the column names like country, then we have country code, region, uh, then we have flag image, URL, then accounts, and the values of them. You can change the name of the label or uh, column label or the name of the column if you want from here and what type of field uh, it is. It is a dimension or major or it's a date field that you can specify. So in the upcoming video or uh, we will discuss more about this like uh, what is the field type. So means like if you select any one uh, type like it's a dimension or it's a major or it's a date. So in the future if you want to sort uh, this particular data set then it will be easy to sort on the basis of the field type you want then i will upload the file so now this data set is in the preparation mode this data set is created as you can see in the pop-up is blocked so i will just go to my private app and in that I have one data set so this is the data set which I have recently created so now this is the lens on that particular data set so to explore that particular data set with the help of lenses and dashboards which we have in the system in the upcoming videos uh, we will see that so this is how we create a data set uh, by uploading a CSV file If you want to edit that particular data set, uh, you can edit it like if you want to save it in another uh, app, you can choose it from here. If you want to change the name of the data set, you can create it from here. Uh, there are some uh, settings to that particular data set. These are the fields. Uh, then when we work on the data sets which are created from objects which are in Salesforce, then we can have the quick actions uh, and that all stuff uh, in that particular settings that we will cover in the upcoming videos uh, thank you have a nice day